Now, let's look at why Pi is so irrational. Why did mathematicians take over 3000 years for their attempt to arrive at the exact value of Pi and why they could not succeed? In spite of us having all these supercomputers, why haven't we been able to figure out this mysterious value at? Can we or can't we calculate the exact value of pi in the future? Well, the answer to this question is no. We can never find the accurate value of pi. We have computed the value of pi accurate up to a trillion decimal points but that is still not accurate. This is because, as you will learn in your higher classes, pi is actually an irrational number, meaning its exact value is inherently unknown. Let me give you a small visualization of this concept. Take a circle. Take the diameter of this particular circle. Let's say I pick this particular diameter. Let me make this diameter a little flexible. That is, I can take this diameter and wrap it around the circle and twist it and turn it and do anything, but its length won't change. Now, let us see how many times this flexible diameter covers this circle. Let's start at this particular point and wrap it around the circle. Now, take the next point and wrap it out here. The same diameter gets wrapped out here. Now, if you're actually seeing, there's a small chunk which is left out. This, if I take from the diameter, I'll have to take 0.14 of the diameter and I fit it into that particular chunk. Now, is this complete? Now, let me see that. Let's zoom in. This part is not still complete, which effectively means there's a smaller part of the diameter which I will need to fit. I take the next smaller part. It happens to be 0.0015 of the diameter. I fit it in there. Now, is this complete? No, it is still not complete. I can say that by zooming in further. Now, if I zoom in further, I see that there is a small part which is not complete. If I keep repeating this exercise, I will see that I will have to take 3.14159265358979323838 and so on and so on and so on. And this value will never stop. Exactly, this value will never stop and it will keep on going on and on and on. And therefore, we say that pi is irrational.